What's happening YouTube? KP Tutorial 13. Let's start building the foundation of our second screen. As you can see in the top right hand corner, we've already um, got the outline there. That's the whole box layout. And we're going to start nesting some box layouts. Okay, so let's do the first one here. Now that the uh, default orientation is horizontal, we want a vertical. Okay, so we're going to put this box layout within our main box layout and it's going to be vertical so that means it's going to um, it's going to add uh, its widgets its child widgets vertically and we're going to do exactly the same we're going to create another box layout and it's going to be vertical as well so the root box layout is going to display these two box layouts horizontally side by side okay I'll put these outlines here just as guides to help you guys out. Uh, I'll probably be putting the uh, the code in the description as well for this one, just so everyone's up to speed. Okay, so let's just neaten this up. Now, what do we want to do here? Let's uh, put another box out. Box layout. Now this box layout is going to contain our node information. Okay, it's basically going to contain a label. Now, in the, in the following tutorials, we're probably gonna um, create this label dy dynamically. Okay, so it's going to be generated dynamically. But for now. Well, we're going to create it so we can see what's going on. Okay, and we want another box layout. And this one here is going to contain our buttons. Now, we want the buttons to be displayed horizontally. So, that's exactly what we're going to do. And let's just add back button so we can get back to the main screen now we can already get back to the main screen because we've got a button below in the other box layout that can get us back there let's give this a slight hint now play around with this guys you don't have to use box layouts you can play around with the other the other box layouts that Kivi's got okay this is just the way I'm doing it I'm sure there's a lot easier way to do it but there you are now let's just uh, make some more buttons because we're going to need them One's going to be for the port scan, one may be for saving the results that we get from the port scan. Okay, and we're going to get into uh, Scapey the Sin Scan in the next tutorial, probably. Um, just some practice to get ready for the port scan coming up. Okay, let's just change this. Now, we need to, let's just run this and see what we've got so far. So, let's run off scan. Okay. Now, that's not right. So, what we're going to do is add a label where that big button was. We're going to add a label on top, okay, so that we can store the port scan results. Okay, and as you can see in the example up top, it looks slightly different because I've created some logos and stuff, which I'm going to be giving you to you guys for free again, but not in this tutorial. Okay, so let's see what that looks like. And we got our nodes, let's get some apple. Alright, so that's basically it, guys. All you've got to do now is just add the backgrounds to the buttons, uh, format the text to whatever you like, as I'm going to do here. And I might push a bit back fast forward. 
dun 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 yeah it's just fast so look at that super speed look at that now this is actually real time for me um, after three or four coffees of course I'm lying so as you can see all I'm doing is um, I'm formatting the text which you guys should know how to do and if you don't shame on you shame on you practice all right so we're just formatting the text to mark up true okay I'm neatening it up mark up true background normal button bg dot pmg this is what caffeine does super speed all right okay and another bit of format in there we've got open ports we've got back mark up true background normal and you've got you guys have got the you should have the images for these because um, I put them in the description in tutorial I don't know what number it was but they're definitely there okay so let's just fix this and back to normal speed well caffeine's run out so save results save results okay now let's just have a quick look at this again just make sure everything's all right run a scan op scan now we should have our the basis the foundation for our screen too and yeah there we have it okay all our buttons okay guys all right thanks for watching uh, thank you for the support. If you like what you watch, don't forget to subscribe and hit the thumbs up. I will appreciate it. Keep coding, keep being awesome. The next tutorial will be um, Scapey Sin Scan, Pod Scan, Funness, Goodness, coming up. See ya.